Yo, what is up, you guys? It's Hyper Sniper back here today. Today's not gonna be a video like a our normal regular video and crap. Um, today I'm gonna be showing you guys the best settings for Fortnite Battle Royale Season Eight. So you know this ain't no scam or anything from last season. But um, I'm gonna show you guys my settings and how good they make me in the game. It's not bad. It's not good. But I I I'd recommend it because uh, a lot of people use the same amount of settings that I use so uh if this helps you help you guys in any way like subscribe and comment in the video and uh, let's get into the actual video so first off let me go to my settings now as you can see I am uh, my wireless controller sensitivity X is when you that's that's when you're turning it's on 0 0.740 my wireless controller sensitivity Y is when you look up that is only 700 target sensitivity is pretty low but for the amount of settings that you have like you're turning and aiming and your look up whatever the heck um, it's 300 scope sensitivity is 600 because you're, you're gonna need that fast scope aiming now you know for the sniper the building sensitivity is gonna be um, 1411 I don't anything around the 1411 up would be good <clears throat> say like 14 1420 because there's really no difference um you don't have to you don't have to copy these but if you want it's okay it ain't gonna do anything for you but just keep going down and then <clears throat> just go down you can see all these other settings that you have um go down to here the controller edit time I would usually use about 120 to about uh, 130. You guys know what the controller edit time is? It's where you, when you press your, you know, your circle or your uh, uh, Xbox controller thingy. I don't know what you. I never played on the Xbox. It's when you press it. It depends on how, like when you press it. It goes faster than it should be. Like when you're about to edit something, it goes probably two times faster than it than it would be. So yeah, you guys. I some people would tell you to put that all the way up, but if you're like new to the game and you press it, it can go by too fast, or you can get confused, and then when you're about to you know fight somebody, you can instantly get confused on that. So just make sure you have it to the point where you know you can um, control it. So if you guys can't control mine, just go go to yours, whatever. Um, now some of you guys already may already know of this part. Um, all we you guys can use custom or Builder Pro. Now you guys it may take you guys a little bit while to get built to get used to Builder Pro. The Builder Pro, the, the, ah, that's what I use. I used to use Combat Pro. It's where you just switch and it, 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 it's just like uh, nah. All these other one other uh, combat controls are not good no more. So I'd recommend, and so would Fortnite or Epic Games recommend you use Builder Pro because they're gonna use faster. All you have to do is click one button, and that's it. You it just comes up. So yeah, um, <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, and comment. Put the notification bell on if this helped you in any way possible. And I'll see you guys in the next Fortnite Battle Royale help gameplay or how-to video. See you guys. Peace.